The latest teen obsession on Netflix has been the Swedish series Young Royals, and it has been finally renewed for a second season. After one season filled with drama and a cliffhanger ending, Netflix just had to release another season. But what do we know about the upcoming season? Well, if you want to learn all about the new season, keep watching as we dive right into it. Season 1 Recap In Season 1, we get introduced to Prince Wilhelm following a fighting scandal that blew up on social media. Due to the scandal, Willem has to make a public apology, and then his family will send him to a boarding school, saying that they have all been there at one point in their lives. Through the season, we get introduced to his brother, Prince Eric, who is the heir of the throne and the future king. When Wilhelm arrives at the school, he meets with his cousin, August, who has been there for three years now. He shows him around, and Willem quickly sees Simon, and the chemistry begins. Throughout the season, we see Willem and Simon build a strong relationship between them, even though it is kept private because of Willem's title and avoiding scandals. Their relationship grows stronger and stronger each day, but by the end of the season, we see that someone leaked a private tape of Willem and Simon. Due to the tape, Simon and Sarah get removed from the school, but Sarah decides to make a deal telling them who leaked the tape in order for her and her brother Simon to stay at the school. Discovering that August released the tape came as a bit of a shock, but what was more shocking was the fact that because of his family, Willem had to deny his involvement with Simon and with that ruining his relationship. Following his brother Eric's death, he is next in line to be the future king, but will he be able to rekindle his relationship with Simon? Release Date Given that Season 1 was released in July 2021, we were shocked to see just how fast the second season was renewed. Usually for a new season to air on Netflix, it takes about a year or so for it to air, but the first season of Young Royals only had 6 episodes and it didn't include any special effects, which makes this show easier to film, and maybe that will give us a release date that is sooner than we expected. However, so far, there isn't a confirmed release date, but many have assumed that by July 2022, we would have the second season. Although, that doesn't mean that a show can air sooner or later. When you take into consideration all that they have to do to film the season, such as filming, writing, editing, promoting, and then finally releasing the season, it can take more than a year even if the show doesn't have a lot of visual effects. At the very worst, it could come back in summer 2023. But we do hope that our favorite characters, Wilhelm, Simon, and August, will return on Netflix sooner than two years from now. Who knows, maybe Netflix will surprise us and give us more than six episodes this time and release the season before July 2022. Cast From what we can tell from the first season, we can presume that the regular cast of Young Royals will return to the second season of the teen drama. We definitely can't picture the series without Edvin writing as Prince Wilhelm, who is the main character in the series and carries the entire storyline. As far as we know, he is making a comeback to reprise his role, along with his fellow co-star and love interest in the show, Omar Rudberg, in the role of Simon. Another actor who will be returning is Wilhelm's mother, Queen Christina, portrayed by Pernilla August. Some other characters that we expect to return are Sarah, Simon's sister, portrayed by Frida Argentino and August, played by Malti Gardinger. One character that we are not expecting to return is Prince Eric, the crown prince and Wilhelm's brother, played by Ivar Frosling, since he tragically died in the series. However, he could return in a few flashbacks if they decide to do so. Some other recurring cast members might come back for the second season, like Simon's mother Linda, played by Carmen Gloria Perez, but there isn't any information on that. As for new cast members, so far, there aren't any, but maybe they will reveal some new shocking characters coming on the show in the future. The Plot We all know how Season 1 ended, and after the leaked tape, the death of Eric, and the rocking relationship between Wilhelm and Simon, Season 2 will have a lot to focus on. We do think that the new season will follow the emotional fallout from the events of Season 1 and will show us again the life of Wilhelm, but now as he tries to manage his royal duties, while still wanting to maintain a relationship with Simon. We do agree that it is hard to constantly be in the public eye and have your every step be monitored, so we can't wait to see what Wilhelm will do. Another thing that we want to see more of is how they handle Eric's death. 
and if we will see him in flashbacks. August and Sarah have also established a connection that makes them want to develop a relationship. But given that August was the one to leak Wilhelm and Simon's tape, we highly doubt that Sarah would want anything to do with him. Well, she was the one to tell them it was August who leaked it, right? As much as we want to love August, he makes it quite impossible to do so. Also, we do hope that Season 2 will also take place at the boarding school and that Wilhelm will go back. Wilhelm and Simon What can we say about this couple that you don't already know? If you are a fan of young royals, then you know all about their relationship. However, with all the fallout they had at the Season 1 finale, we were doubtful if the two can get back together. And then, at the final moments of Season 1, Wilhelm confesses to Simon that he loves him, leaving their story up in the air. Of course, we all want them to be together again, we just hope that Simon could forgive Wilhelm for everything he has done. They have quickly become a couple throughout Season 1, and even though their relationship was kept a secret, they care deeply for one another. Now after Eric's death and the tape getting leaked, Wilhelm was put under a lot of pressure, being the next ruling king, and also the drama and scandal involving the tape. Wilhelm decided to listen to his mother and tell the media that he denies any involvement in the tape. And with Simon, this hurt Simon quite deeply, making their relationship rocky if there was even one left. But there wouldn't be a season if there weren't any hope for them. We do believe and hope that Wilhelm will finally make things official and public with Simon, and the two can stop hiding from everyone and own their relationship. August faces consequences. As for August, he quickly became a villain in the show over the course of season one. From the start, he was the troublemaker at the school. No wonder he was there for three years. He used Simon to get him alcohol and drugs since he was able to walk outside of the school. And then he refused to pay him the money he owed him. Besides all the mean and bad stuff he has done, he remains in high social standing with the school and with the royal family who helped to pay his tuition. After all of this, he still decided to hurt his cousin by leaking a private tape to the entire world. In the end, Sarah did tell that August was the one who leaked the tape. So in season 2, we do expect that August might get some punishment for what he has done or some kind of a consequence for his actions. Now that Felice also knows, many are hopeful that she will be the one to take down August and get him kicked out of school. On a related note, we wanted to know, what do you expect to happen in the upcoming season of Young Royals? Let us know in the comment section below. If you'd like to see more amazing videos such as this one, make sure to like this video, subscribe, and hit the bell icon so you never miss any of them. And as always, thanks for watching guys.